Hello and welcome back to Trash It. Moji, good to have you back. Thank you. Welcome back. Welcome back. Thank you. She's like seasonal pro now. I know. <laughs> and welcome back. Thank you. Order. <laughs> Just leave me alone, please. Continue. Tell, no, tell me what's happening with you today. You're all green. Yes. I'm just, you know, giving you guys a, bell, a bit of brain from and, Peter you know, Pan. Okay. It's not like I had a bad head or anything like that. I was that. just going to ask. <laughs> <are you laughs> Thank just you. ignore her anyway. Oh, how are you? I'm good. How was your week? Good, good. I can see you're reminiscing of wherever you are because I'm not sure where you are. But there's some culture going on here. She yeah, has. I'm trying. I'm trying. Okay, it's a phone in, mm. not a phone in, in the sense that we've got our lovely subscribers. Mm -hmm. As usual, they always send us messages. They value your opinion, they value your stay, your take, your diversity to things. So today we've, we've got someone that sent us a message, and your sister girlfriend, we're going to read your message. So, and we need you guys to honestly weigh in. And I look at both of you because I usually get some, especially when Moji is in. There's <laughs> something that Moji rubs off on. Oh, I'm sorry, like isn't it? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Me sorry. <laughs> <laughs> on Celia. Yes. Yes. And you can see the, the lioness coming out of her. So I'm going to yeah, wait. All right, okay. I'm going to read it. And it says, Hi, Trashy. I live in Lagos, Nigeria. Oh, wow. Hey, Nigeria. Come on, guys. Yeah. All right. <laughs> <laughs> My issue is a fear of STD. I have been married for six years now and recently confirmed my husband is cheating. That's not news. And seeing multiple ladies. He goes out with his friend often to bars, comes home late at night. My worry is, as a married couple, we have unprotected sex, which you should do. Mm. And the thought, of, the thought of STD is making me freak out. Please, should I stop having sex with him? Or how can I insist or force him to start wearing condoms when we have sex? And please, 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 I've thought about breaking up, but that's not an easy thing because of our culture. It's frowned upon in Nigeria. I wouldn't say Nigeria, but across where mm -hmm. we're from. Given that people in this part of the world accept poly polygamy, my family won't support me leaving him just because he cheats as he treats me well. Okay. Mm. So, ladies, what say you? complicated it is it Very is especially the last bit where she yeah, said don't tell exactly. me to leave. does he know that you know that he's cheating mm. Mm. that should be the first question okay if he doesn't know tough so Chances my advice he yeah he probably doesn't know so my advice to you sister is the next time you're about to have sex with him whip out your condom and tell him to put it on tell him to strap on okay, okay? And if he said, oh, I was this, because he's going to ask to see if, uh, where's this coming from. Mm -hmm. And you're going to say, well, it's up to you. You can wear it or not. But um, until you stop sleeping with those girls out there, mm -hmm. I'm not going to allow you to have sex with me without a condom. Yeah, but what if he says I've stopped? Then you yeah. need to go and get checked first before we can resume activities without the uniform. Mm. That's how I say it. But then how do you trust? Because as you're right to say he might stop for a little period of time but that doesn't mean he won't get tempted Let's do it again. to do it again because if that is just his character yeah he will go again and get tempted and whatever so what do you do then what every month you're going to be testing him as long as i know that he's cheating then i'm gonna have him use condom i'm gonna have him tested on if i if i if he go if he if he's tested and he's all clear and he's fine and then he then goes out and does it again obviously i'm not gonna know that so yeah. unbeknown to me i will probably carry on sleeping with him without a condom but then as far as i'm concerned once i know then, then can i step in then why not just minute. have him just use the condom and just well you can't let me let me let let me let me also, also, also he say she's saying he treats me well. Mm -hmm. How does he treat you well if he's cheating and you're with yeah. multiple people? Yeah. I don't really... He has money, isn't he? Alright, so financially she mm. gets... Okay, then... So what are you? Then, then she needs to decide what's more important to yeah. her. Is her, her health and her life span like, important to her? Mm. Or is the money of her enjoying things? She can't have it both. And if that's, that's what she you wants... can't have it both. Yeah, well, exactly. I mean, well, in her relationship mm. she can't have it both. So she needs to decide, actually... I think if you know someone's cheating on you, for me, 
physical abuse, cheating, it's a no-no. Mm. Everything else you can work out or whatever, but you know he's cheating on you. But if you're saying, oh, what are people going to say or what are people don't say, then you're more worried about your financial gain from mm. the relationship. And in that case, put up and shut up. And if you get a well, then she's the thing is, No, listen, and the thing what? is, what are people going to say if you end up with the STD or oh. HIV? Because then people are going to think no, no, you're the promiscuous one. Let me one. tell you a story. Okay. I've got a medical doctor friend, she's relocated to the States now, and this is just confidentiality. She didn't mention the names of the parties involved. There's a prominent um, person in Lagos, Nigeria, that apparently is living with HIV. Oh, okay. And he takes his medication, his viral loads, and blah, blah, blah. What he does is check up. And out of curiosity, the lady was like, oh, well, she's a medical doctor. You come around, I see you every three, six months. How come the missus, she been treated, treated somewhere else? And it was like, she doesn't know. <clears throat> wow. So this guy can be capping it all over the streets of Lagos with wow. girls. And he's taking care of himself. And he's yeah. having unprotected yeah, sex. Can afford, oh my God. He's having unprotected oh sex. God. And he's taking care of himself. He's going to his appointment. He's taking his medication. Do you get what I'm saying? Yeah. Other than most circumstances, you find that person, you could actually sue them for manslaughter. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 How do you then explain this especially when you've got family members that don't see any problem with a man cheating so to say i should be cheating stop eating you now just close your eyes to that side the whole family is doing well and you're like well i don't want to die young yeah, mm -hmm. yeah and as you rightfully say a lot of people that have hiv is not literally looking like they're dying because as you say they yeah. have a lot of medication now mm -hmm. that they could live a long life that they wouldn't tell you that, oh, that, that would tell you? the statistics of black ethnic minority in the Lewisham, Greenwich and Sadok area. Yeah. Predominantly uh, when we pick yeah. up, especially the Nigerians, we're talking about quite a, a lot of, it, yeah. of people. In the, in the UK. And so this is it is really scary now because apparently um, they did a statistic and it says nearly one in five carry the HIV in those wow. boroughs. Which means wow. that is quite well, shocking. Mm. Mm. But then the thing is what I was reading as well with HIV I don't know about other. This no, this no, this no, 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 but one thing with other. No, but one thing with other STD mm. yeah. is that basically um, sometimes, even though they have it, they they're just a carrier. Mm. They don't infect people. But this is one thing. But then it becomes dangerous because then. What well, everybody now we have issues like where you know we get normally tested in this country and you see people who've got chlamydia and we've got mm -hmm. gonorrhea syphilis and they've been dominant and then have a, a knock-on effect on their fertility in the, in the yeah, last yeah, years exactly. yeah. but the question today is what do we tell sister girlfriend personally i'm of the opinion you, I, can't say I, you I, tell him i don't him. think she's that bothered if she should you reckon yeah because i think she should already be asking him to use a condom. I don't yeah, think it's yeah, rocket condom, science. Yeah. I don't think it's something she, she should be necessarily. I'm not saying she shouldn't ask advice, but I'm yeah. just saying like if you want to yeah, protect yourself. Yeah, but I think yourself, she's thinking how do you? Because if you haven't nah, been you using condoms, nah, you need to come up and say I say? know. You don't need to. Yeah, worry. That's what I why mean, are you pretending? Yeah. I know yeah. you're cheating, so let's just get on with yeah. it. If you still want to be sleeping with me. You've yeah, come and end the story. So that she means is, she's actually accepting the fact yeah, that yeah, she's yeah. a second fiddle no, in her own marriage. It. She needs to accept it. And this is or kind leave. of yeah. And Ooh. this is kind of sounding to she me like leave. it's sounding to me like okay, you know, um, she, she's but, not. She's not. She, she's not like a wife anymore. She's almost like a mistress that's in the house. Because really? the hus I mean, that's how I'm saying it. Because your husband is cheating on you, but he's treating you well. So now you're you're thinking to yourself, okay, he's cheating on me, but he's treating me well. So I don't want to say anything. I don't want to say anything yeah. to mess it up, yeah, yeah, yeah. which is what mistresses yeah. do. They just yeah. thank you. Up shut exactly. Up they're getting all the money. Yes. Yeah. It's so easy to do. <laughs> but yeah. the thing is, I agree with her because it's not just the STD. I mean, you get you could get like sexual transmitted disease through your mouth and all sorts of stuff. You understand? So when he's there kissing those women as well, and he come mm -hmm. home, how do you say to him as well? I don't want to give you down there. Okay, you could protect down there with, with, with the condom. Yeah, but how yeah, about the mouth? And the thing is, is her fear the fact that so he's gonna... gone down there? Yeah, exactly. oh, yeah. yeah. Don't know. And is 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 her fear also? him asking her how did you find out hmm. because you know some men are very they're very yeah, like that yeah, how did true. you find out oh you've yeah. been you've been checking up on me or you've mm. been looking through my phone That's or you've been yeah, 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 so maybe yeah, she's true. afraid of it's that true. and afraid of losing him and losing her so now it's not asked. even it's yeah. not even her leaving him it's the possibility of him leaving her and trying to change the story around by saying you need to decide 
is she more important or is her marriage more important or is he more important? She just needs to decide. Because if she's trying to protect him to say, oh, he's now going to say, where did I find out yeah. from? That means she's worried about his feelings. Yeah. But, but he's she not, might he's not worried about her feelings. Yeah, true. Which means yeah. she should, I think she should, she just put up and shut up. Yeah. If she gets it at the end, she deals with it, takes medication, yeah, but carries on. Wow. Yeah. The same Work thing. Worse than There's AIDS. medication for everything now. Takes medication and well, get they're not. They're not cheap, are they? Because no. some people would be like, if you didn't know, you would still thing. be cheap. You would still be sleeping with him anyway. Yeah, yeah. So it's almost like okay, the knowledge has now brought that kind yeah. of thought to say, oh, actually, I know. Mm, but actually, yeah. there's a lot of people that their husbands are cheating mm, and yeah. they don't actually know. And well, they, some of them and even give them the condom. Yeah, yeah. And, and they're and they're actually yeah. doing. They're just getting on with the marriage. I mm. think she should just get on with it and maybe just like pretend she doesn't know, or she should just say, I know this is condom and that's it. But can I tap on that because since you said um, a lot of people do know that their husband is cheating. It's true, some of them, and what a lot of them do now is say, Okay, if you're gonna be cheating, here's the condom. I'm giving you the condom because I know to you're gonna go with, yeah, because yeah, well, I know you're going in there. Hold on, hold on. So, so, and she knows. Well, 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 this is how I view relationship it's meant to be you and I. It's like giving you condoms, I'm inviting all the no, Holy so Spirit's no, demons. No, no, it's like you're protecting yourself. The thing is, it's so many dogs. So, it's not Not that I would do that, is bullshit. I'm sorry, you cheat on me, bye, okay. But She's some different. people would do it. Can I just go back to you, Moji? You said something now. So she, yeah, a friend of mine gives her partner condoms anytime he goes to Nigeria on See? holiday. Yes, in condoms. Because she knows what he's doing. No, recently. Yeah. But then again, I just think you know what? Whether you give him condom or not, he might still not use it anyway. Yeah, so. Yeah. It's you're you're yeah, almost yeah. kind of condoning to say okay, yeah. I'm giving you a condom. Yeah, I'm aware of it. So you're kind of like yeah, giving him license. Whereas and to he be honest, might enjoy he, it might, more. he might still not still use the condom anyway. Oh, yeah. well, he, the but then too. he's gonna cheat more because now he knows that oh she knows I'm yeah, cheating. Yeah. So yeah, let me even cheat more. And he might still not use the condom. So yeah, yeah. It's like, Ugh. See, I don't agree with any kind of cheating. But is as there I said, a form it, of cheating? Cheating is cheating. Yeah, it is. But as I said, I feel sorry for her because at the end of the day, it sounds like she is in love with this guy. Mm. And she doesn't want to break what she thinks is a good relationship. Mm. But then, as you well. say, clearly, a good relationship is not what he's doing, is he? Okay, so what's our um, advice for sister? My condom. Sorry. <sighs> condom. She needs to use condom. Yeah, I mean, yeah, condoms. I can't think of anything else. I can't. You know, I'm, I'm trying to think. It's, you can't castrate him, but anyway. I don't, <laughs> yeah, I don't, I'm trying to think. <laughs> ah, you know, I don't think she should that. stop having oh sex Oh my gosh. She definitely can't do that. No, 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 but wait, but, 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 but wait, the thing is, That's not the option, thing is, no. regardless of what, her health is more important than her marital duties. Well, then she should leave concerned. then if that's what you're going okay. to say. Okay. She doesn't leave. want to leave, okay, it's sis? Your health is more important than your marital duties, okay? Because he's getting in now anyway, okay, mm -hmm. from all these yeah, other sisters exactly. out there. So. You, if you were ever going to move on from this relationship, yeah, do you want to move on with, with STD, STD yeah. and HIV? Mm. Well, it's do you understand? So my my yeah, she my, my advice, that stage. Yeah. Yeah. my yeah. advice to you is stop having sex with him no. until he wears a condom. Period. That's my advice. My advice to you is there's something called communication, okay? And the earlier you start talking about things, the better mm, for you. I agree because. In all fairness, there's no harm in sitting your husband down. Well, you do cheat. Mm. Mm -hmm. There's let's just call it a spade a spade. And for my own sanity, that if you wish to remain in the relationship for the foreseeable future, we will be using condoms. condoms. Yeah. Now, if you do not agree, I don't think how we can continue with me having sex with you and you continue out unprotected. Yeah. unprotected. Yeah. Now, if you've not been testing yourself, please, this is the time for you to go mm. and get yeah. tested. Yeah. It's within five days you get your HIV results. There are other things that you can be tested for and maintain mm -hmm. a regular culture of checking. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Don't just wait till when the, the, the deuces are up. Mm -hmm. And for your own sanity, I, 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 I might sound mean, the marriage doesn't define you. If you're not happy there, mm -hmm. talk, look at your options. Money is not everything. We've seen yeah. instances just today now. I just received a news that a very young lady that I know doing well originally died today. And you think about it. 
That's nobody's guaranteed sharp. tomorrow oh, yeah. mm -hmm. you can literally walk out of here and die exactly. so why do i want to be tied down in this relationship where i'm not happy if you're not happy she's not happy she's not happy because there's fake financially she's 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 okay but other see that's yeah. not there's some people everyone marries for a reason yeah. and not everybody marries for love mm -hmm. so and there is some people so you think that they're married for love? Not, yeah, yeah. yeah but there is some people that marry it for not money per se but if they're comfortable mm -hmm. they they're are actually happy because yeah. there is people that know that their partners cheat and they're happy mm -hmm. happy as in like i accept it some women even blatantly tell you there's no man that doesn't cheat in this world yeah, so yeah. they yeah. so they accept it they know it it's cool but exactly. I'm looked after so and they just they are actually happy you can't yeah. say people like that are not happy because yeah. they're her husband and I think but, but no happy. but they're happy but deep down they would wish yeah the reverse was but the case. they would wish that their partners weren't cheating but then Celia if she's asking for help it sounds like she genuinely yeah she's not happy no 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 not that she's not happy but no. she genuinely have feelings for this guy she doesn't just want to just dump him just like that because as you say if you're not really no, in love you could just say to the other guy well, let me tell you something you know, sometimes when people don't have options well you have to look mm. on how to maintain your option mm. and i don't know if she's got kids like it's yeah. easy it for you to move on if you just got one child it's kind of gets difficult when you've got three or four because mm. ain't nobody gonna be yeah. messing around with you she's got four kids oh no 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 it's a, it's another liability. It's so, part of the world too, isn't it? Exactly. And she's mm. thought about it. Well, I'm just I don't know this woman from from Adam. I'm just thinking, maybe she's wear options and she's coming short, especially if she's got no income of her own, if she's not working and if That's she's true. relying on yeah. the husband. So I don't know. It's a catch twenty two. Also, yeah. really saying that about her, him, the like maintaining the whole sex thing. Like if she stops having sex with him. It's only him that's gonna lose out. Actually, she's losing that as well for oh, showing. Yes. But yeah, because yeah, if you stop having sex with your husband, yeah. then that means she's not gonna be having sex. Yeah, yeah. Well, 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 make her unhappy even worse. <laughs> So you rather have sex with your husband even though he's Listen, cheating yeah, but she's, 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 got, she's, she's got needs as well. Yeah, I'm trying to say because her husband is cheating yeah, that's and right. getting satisfied. Yeah. But she she at the end of the month, that can make that happen. Exactly. There are things that can make that happen. It's not the same, man. No, okay, so, no, no wait. But if I know... She might not want to be... No, she might not want to be... No, I'm just saying. She might not want to be, as you say... Climb where a rabbit. Yeah, because then means she has to go... So, are you trying to say to me? sleeping with somebody Yeah, no, no, that is not somebody else. husband is cheating on me and there's a possibility that I may get HIV, STIs or STDs, I will now, because I want to satisfy my sexual urge, continue I, I, to I was telling to you as a family. I want that sexual urge. No, I won't. I won't. Because I'm afraid of my health. Okay. I'm sorry. Oh my See, sex is overrated though. I don't know what people are thinking. Do you understand? Because it's five minutes and it is over. Okay? No, no. Let's make it seven. Okay? Let's add another two minutes to it. Okay? So please don't tell me that because you want to have an orgasm, yeah? Or you want to enjoy something for seven minutes. You're going to put yourself at risk of HIV. She like what he does. No, no, the guy will actually be very good. I don't care how good you are. I'd make you two bitter rabbits then, okay? I'm sorry, but I'm not going to put myself in jeopardy just because of sex. Nah. Not happening. We all have needs. Yeah, I know. Yeah. And in as much as I respect the man <laughs> and I respect Mr. Rabbit, because Mr. Ma guy, Mr. Rabbit, Rabbit is very good at whatever he does. But on, on a more serious <laughs> on a more serious note, I would say, like the four ladies have said it, communication, yeah. condom, and most importantly, don't sell yourself sure. shorts. Ha! Yeah. Ah, check yourself. And don't wreck yourself. Speak to this mm. guy. This is why. No, the streets are saying you don't have to pull your sources out no. there. Like, yeah. I heard. Yeah. And please, if it's true, I don't know. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I don't. Yeah. What say you? Yeah, no, you're right. You're saying yeah. I heard. 
I know. I saw. Told me. I saw. Uh, yeah, you can't go to your husband and be saying, "Oh, you don't want to say who said that." That that doesn't make any mm. sense. You, you, you know. just put the you, person you, on blast. You, you, mm. Listen, you're gonna have to because at the end of the day, the person bringing well, it to you. That's you need to that uh, all that. Oh, I'll tell you, but it's confidential. But don't tell him uh, that you know. Or don't tell him you heard yeah. from me. But I know you're trying to like not mm. think. By the end of the day, if it's a relationship, especially your husband and wife thing, mm. you need to say, "I heard. I know. I know this is who mm. told me. Your best friend. Your mom. Your, your sister. sister yeah. <laughs> yeah. Make it really family table. member. <laughs> because if you just say, "Oh, I know," but like, then you, oh no, the person. Lie, lie, yeah, all that would, kind of drama, yeah. you can't really get to the bottom of it because you yourself are not being honest. So, yeah, say yeah. the source, say everything, lay it out, put all your cards out there. Yeah. So, our viewers watching this, if you've got anything for our lovely sister in Lagos, Nigeria, let us know. Either send it to us via DM, put it in the chat room, or put it in the, on our Instagram yeah. page. Well, I'm or sure she'll comment. Yes, yeah, I'm yeah, sure she'll be reading this. Anyway, so, yeah. Um, we wish you all the best in your relationship. Yeah. It's a relationship. Yeah. The, the, and just pray. Yeah, yeah pray. Just, yeah. Yeah, just to address. Oh. So it's not, it's not, it's not like that's not like that's if you didn't mention it. Just pray. Yeah, yeah. yeah, just pray actually because you know when men when people are promiscuous, especially sexually, there might be a demon inside of them. And Michelle's gonna break it. Do you understand what I'm saying? There might be a demon inside of everyone on this panel. Okay. 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 It was nice okay. trash it. Like I said, anytime Moji and Celia <laughs> get together, they come off at our now. So until next week, thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.